Hi, today I want to share the Hemingway writing mode with you. Um, recently, I, 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 I've started to uh, write a lot more and I was looking into what are kind of the best working writing environments, ecosystems uh, around there and, and um, which do the people use and why. And um, I came across one which was frequently mentioned and that's drafting.com. And um, well, basically, I mean, it's a distraction free editor, as you can see, it's just like, this is just text. Um, it's very simple. Um, um, and, and it has one cool feature that I've never heard of before, which is the Hemingway mode. I, you know, I looked into the menus and I was like, what is Hemingway mode? And once activated, I'm writing, oh, and making mistake. So I want to go back. Oh, but I cannot go back. So I'm, I'm pressing, as you can hear, I'm pressing backspace, but I cannot go back. Um, so yeah, apparently this is Hemingway mode. And um, I was, I was, I've never heard of that before. And, um, but it's a really cool thing because the, the, the basic idea is, and apparently it goes back to Hemingway because he used to write in that way. Um, you just, first you produce, then you you edit. So first you put down like as, as, as you would do with pen and paper, you just put down your text and later on you can uh, think about the editing and um, the corrections. Um, so, but I, 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 I was thinking, I, I don't want to be kind of just buying to, to using drafting um, to have that mode. And I was thinking, can I have that in any kind of editor? Because maybe my preferred editor is something like the minimalist markdown. Hello, I have a preview. Um, so I, I want to use my own editor with Hemingway mode. And um, well, luckily, if you're on Linux, <laughs> I'm not saying that it, uh, that doesn't work with uh, Windows, but uh, at least on Linux, I have found a solution. And you might consider switching to Linux, which is open source and, 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 and better and greater anyway. So <laughs> give it a try if that is the reason you need it to have. And um, on Linux, this is fairly easy to do. Basically, I mean, I described it also here in, in, in post, uh, you can read on later. Um, basically, the, 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 the basic idea is we just block the backspace key, and that's fairly easy to do. So first, we run this comment xf, which is in an event tester. So let's open your comment line. Um, I happen to be on Ubuntu, but uh, I mean, this is really, um, just so generic and applicable to, to any kind of distribution. So we type XEF, and what XEF does is for every key you press, as you can see, I mean, here I'm pressing C, um, it gives you the key code and the key sim. So C has the key code 54 and the key sim 0x63. But we don't want C, we want backspace. So I press backspace, oh, and cool. Key code 22 key, key sim 0xff08. That's all we want to know, all right? So press it, um, let's press it a couple of times to have it like um, prominent in my comment line. Let's close XEF. And um, so what you need to do, I'm not sure if, if backspace is always mapped to um, 22. So it might be different in your system and, and certainly the keys might be different. So take down that. And um, now what we do is um, we run, um, the comment x mod map with the e flag, and um, we basically assign our backspace key, which has the key code twenty two, to an empty key sim. So basically zero zero zero. That that just tells basically your computer um, don't assign any function to that key. Um, so let's try it out. So we take this one. Um, there's a small mistake. Be aware of these double quotes. I have no idea um, how to fix that in, in WordPress. Um, it's a wrong quote. So um, once you put them in, make sure you use um, your correct double quotes. Bam, there we go. So let's go back into my Markdown editor. I'm not in drafting. So as you, as you know from before, it didn't work. I didn't have any Hemingway mode. So I am... I am writing, and now I want to go back. Oh, oh, but I cannot. So, see, how you keep, 
like you keep hearing me pressing, <laughs> but nothing happens. That's wonderful. Okay, but how do I get back? Um, well, because sometimes you certainly need your uh, backspace. Um, so basically, going back is easy. You take the same key code, 22, and you, you assign it to the original um, key sim function. So let's take this one. Let's go back into the comment. Tuck. Again, I need to fix uh, the, the wrong double quotes. Tuck. And now, please tell me that they are working. Yes, look. I can go back. Fine, that's great. Wow. So, I I'm I'm really I'm really um, I really like this mode. Um, I must say it it really is a great um, new feeling of writing. But uh, remembering these comments is fairly uh, tedious. So, um, just I mean as an idea, um, just go into your keyboard settings. Depending on your distribution, that might be different. And then create a custom shortcut to disable and enable the backspace. And then you can assign it to a key by using exactly the comments that we just discussed. Um, the X mode map empty and to enable the X mode map reassigned. Um, so let's test it. I mean, <laughs> I don't want to uh, show you anything and then um, just basically showing you a flaw or something that doesn't even work but it does so look now i press Control super alt d oh ho, ho, ho. i cannot go back and now i press Control super alt e to enable yeah fine cool um so I, I hope that was useful. Um, try it out yourself. Um, how what what the Hemingway writing mode does to you? I mean, it's nothing really fancy, but um, it's it's just something where you don't need an extra app or a, a new fancy program, which is it just can be done with your normal tools and um, to keep your system lean and clean and to focus on just what you want to do. So I hope that was um, in some ways useful and um, maybe by discovering Hemingway mode. Who knows, maybe you will be the next big Hemingway. Thank you.